The one change I would make would be to stop the death penalty. People are executed all around the world, uh, famously in America, for example. And I think the death penalty enshrines killing people in law, and that should be stopped. The problems that stopping the death penalty would solve, firstly, you would never execute an innocent person ever again. There are many well-documented cases of people around the world who have been executed, who have later been found to be innocent. There's a guy called Cameron Todd Willingham, who was executed in America for arson, for burning down his house with his children inside, and he refused a plea, de uh, a plea deal. He would never say he was guilty to escape execution and subsequent investigations have shown that he was almost certainly innocent but he went to his death with his wife thinking he had killed his family. The death penalty is very expensive. It costs states literally millions of dollars per person. Money that I feel would be better spent on education, mental health, coverage and welfare for children in need. And a lot of the people who end up on death row start off living in deprivation. A lot of the time they're abused as children. And I feel if you're going to spend money on their lives, you should spend money trying to improve it and stop them from going into a life of crime rather than putting them in prison or executing them as a result of things they do in later life. It would also stop the pain of, uh, suffered by their victims and their victims' families. I feel that having the death penalty as a legal instrument sends out a message that somehow you can solve problems just by killing people. And if you get rid of the death penalty, if you start to feel like you have to solve problems in another way, then I would hope that that would start to start the process of stopping people thinking there in any way that it's acceptable to kill other people. If, if you look at it statistically, you're more likely to face the death penalty if you're a black person who executes, who, who murders a white person rather than if you're a white person who murders a black person, for example. And I think there are a lot of social inequality issues that relate to the death penalty and the way that it is applied. And I feel like despite the onward movement towards equality across gender and across race, the death penalty is, is really quite archaic in the way that it is applied. So I would hope that removing the death penalty be, would be one more step towards social equality. When I went to visit Troy Davis on death row in Georgia, I remember just being in prison and I'm sitting as close as I am to the camera with this guy who was facing execution and was subsequently executed. And I remember just sitting there thinking, why can't we just take him out with us? Why can't we just bust him out of this jail that had you know, 15 meter high fences with more razor wire than you've ever seen at the top of them? And uh, it just struck me that the man I was sitting opposite was just another human being. It's just a person and if we're going to Human beings put themselves uh, as, as different from animals and different from everything else on the planet. And I think the one way that we can separate that is by having a sense of fairness and trying to be better as we move forward. And it feels like the human race is just a sort of experiment and a social experiment. And we need to continue to change things in order to make the world a better place. And I think uh, if you stop killing each other, that's a pretty good place to start.